is going on guys, Marty, and welcome to another Minecraft video. So today guys, I want to show you how to install Optifine. Uh, to install Optifine, it's very simple. First of all, what you have to do is just come to this page here. I'm going to have this link available for you guys in uh, you know video description. So when you come here, just come down all the way until you get to the Optifine HDB standard for Minecraft 1.2.3. Uh, when you've done this, just come down here uh, where it says download one. Uh, click on this. And... Um, Make sure you only download this if you have Minecraft latest update. Okay, just waiting for it to say preparing. Okay, so if I just click this now, it's going to download. I have it automatically, you know, uh, downloading straight into my download file. Uh, but I already have a copy of it in my desktop, which is this one here. So all we have to do when you get this, after you've saved it into whatever folder you want to save it to, uh, just double click on it, open it, uh, put this on one side. Oh, make sure you close this. Uh, put this on one side and then go here and type percent app data percent hit enter and then you should get this page minimize put it on one side as well open this and then go into bin folder uh, go into your minecraft.jar open with winrar and then as well uh, close this as well okay just slide this to the side and then come down here make sure you delete first meta inf hit enter when this done, uh, select all of this uh, in the you know the Optifine folder. Just select all of them, and then just uh, drag them into the Minecraft.jar, which is this one here. And then it will ask you if you want to copy. Just say OK, and you're done. Just close everything else now, and that's pretty much it. So now, if you open your Minecraft, OK. And then go into your whatever single player. Um, let's just go into here, into your ward. So I just created this just to kind of test it and show you how it works. Okay, so when you're in your ward, guys, just go to option now. And then in here, if you go to video settings, you have a ton of things that you can play around uh, to maximize, you know, the FPS, the frame per seconds, and uh, improve the render distance and the chunks, loading, and all that stuff. So if you're recording with fraps and you're having a lag, so go ahead, you know, use this. It's definitely going to improve your uh, fraps and all that. And hopefully, you can have uh, a much smoother recordings, which are definitely things I need it for myself because I have a lot of problems when I'm actually recording. So in here, you got a lot of things you can play around with, and the quality as well improve certain things you could turn on and off so i hope you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to uh, comment rate and subscribe and uh, let me know what you guys think about it so i'll see you guys later take care for now and uh, bye bye